Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video, I will show you a game between Heinz and Bocha. This very beautiful chess game was played in Germany in 1973. Heinz had white pieces and she started with e4. Bocha played e5. Knight to c3, knight to c6, white to move. d3 was played, perhaps f4. Vienna game was expected. After d3 we have bishop to b4, pinning the knight, the absolute pin. Bishop to d2, unpinning. Knight to f6 and f4 now. Pawn takes pawn on f4. Knight to f3 and the bocha castle the king's side. Bishop to e2, rook to e8, aligning the rook with the white king. a3 asking a question, bishop to a5. B4 attacking the bishop, bishop to b6, and white happily recaptured the pawn on f4. White would love to castle next, but this is not possible straight away, so perhaps knight to a4 and knight takes bishop on b6 is on the menu. Play with the black pieces, don't waste any time. d5 striking in the center, this is what you want to do when your opponent didn't castle. White to move. Bishop to g5 was played. If knight to a4, black may play d takes on e4, or even bishop to g4. So, player with the white pieces played bishop to g5. This is a pin, a relative pin. White is moving the same piece for the third time. Is it bad? d takes on e4. Knight takes on e4. There is lots of pressure on the black knight on f6. Knight to d4. c3 attacking the knight. What would you do? Please pause and find the best move for black. What did you find? The knight on d4 didn't move. There was a surprise of epic proportions. And the move is, knight takes pawn on e4, sacrificing the queen. What a shocker. Bishop takes queen on d8. For a millisecond, bishop was feeling like Messi after scoring a goal. But only for a millisecond. Black to move. What was the idea behind the queen sacrifice? How would you continue? Play with the black pieces continued with. Knight takes on f3 check. G takes on f3. Black. Play the move. And white resigned. Believe it or not. The move is. Bishop to f2 check. White resigned in view of this continuation. King to f1. Bishop to h3. Check. Mate. Fun. Fantastic. The lesson learned is, do not bet all your money on a relative pin. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.